you know, Jeannie is just devastated. This is like her, like I told told you earlier, her brother. Um, it was just great of the Bus family to do that for Kobe, and that's how much he meant to not only the Bus family but also to Laker Nation and all the great Laker fans we have around the world. I, I appreciate your time, Magic. Thanks so much, man. And we, and like we always say, you, you know, we just got to keep the faith. Yeah, this is not a conversation I ever wanted to have. And, uh, it's been, it's my heart's just been broken. You know, I got out of church and found this out, and it's just, I just still can't believe it. Not, not Kobe, not Kobe. But uh, we have to pray and uh, pray for his family, also for his mom and dad. I played against Joe, his father, Jelly Bean. So we want to pray for him and his sisters as well and his kids and, uh, again, his beautiful wife. And so that they can, you know, have the strength to carry on. And, and uh, Jim, thank you and Pat and everybody at the mm-hmm. studio for mm-hmm. what you guys have been doing for us today, just to share the memories, share some of the, the clips of uh, Kobe and uh, telling his story as well. So thank you, guys. All right, Urban, thank you, man. Appreciate God it. God bless Thank you. God bless you. He's, uh, that's one of, the more, one of the most thoughtful individuals uh, I have ever been around talking about, about magic. And just to hear one superstar, oh, that's a mega star, talk of, be in awe right. of another. For him to say, you know, he was the greatest yes. Laker. Yes. Oh, my God. I, I, I immediately, upon hearing my, about this, and I was with some women from Michigan, two of them mm-hmm. from Lansing. We happened to be talking about Irvin on our trip. And remember when Irvin retired, that was such a blow to especially Los Angeles, especially for those who had watched him play. He wasn't, he didn't have his family at the time, but we were so saddened to hear that he wasn't gonna play anymore. And and the question, who could possibly, who could possibly light up this city again? Who could possibly provide that spark for the Lakers to win championships? Because let's face it, right, Jim? Mm -hmm. This is a championship nation. That's what it's about. Championship city. And then here comes 17-year-old Kobe Bryant, straight out of high school, and just immediately became the superstar with the Lakers. And to get to watch, listen to Irvin, and to, to watch Kobe, both of them when they, they got married and they had children, so to watch them raise their kids and really to hear Irvin talk about Kobe like that because he really did take him under his wing. It's just very, it's so sad it's also very touching and, and, and heartwarming. He will, he will always live in our hearts. There's no question. Always, always live in no our hearts. No question yeah. about It's amazing that. what Magic said about nobody took more pride in putting on a Lakers uniform 